All right, guys, we're back here. We're doing tips and tricks with heavy. What I'm going to do uh, here right now is a little kind of a, a cooking demonstration or something that I do, like if we're going to go offshore. And uh, we're always looking for different things to eat offshore that's quick and easy that you can grab. So uh, what we're going to do today is we're just going to do uh, some chicken thighs. Chicken thighs are pretty uh, reasonably priced. Um, you know, so, you know, cook them off, throw them in a Ziploc bag, put some barbecue sauce on them. When, you know, when fishing's, you know, slow, you reach in, you can grab one. They're good cold. You know, season them up, brown them off, make sure you crisp, crisp down, the, you know, the skin, get all the fat rendered on them. But, uh, you know, cook them all the way through. And, uh, you know, it's a good little, uh, a good little snack for, uh, you know, when you're out there. It, you don't have to buy, spend a lot of money. A lot of times guys spend a ton of money going to the supermarket, buying those kind of things, buying fried chicken, stuff like that. It's things that you can do at home, you know, to make it, you know, it's better. You know, I mean, nothing's better than home home cooked. I mean, fried fried chicken is one thing, but you know what? Going out on the uh, on the boat and having some barbecue chicken there for yourself, you can do it with thighs, you can do it with legs. So uh, we're gonna do that today. We're gonna season them up with a little lemon pepper, and then we're gonna uh, render, you know, skin size down, brown them real, real, real good, and then we're gonna put them in the oven and finish them off. Uh, once again, you know, uh, tips and tricks with heavies brought to you by. Uh, boatloans.com so please check out boatloans.com whether you're buying a new boat or refinancing the boat you already have please check out boatloans.com thank you and i hope this uh helps out a little uh, bit this tip yeah, we'll put our chicken thighs get them nice and seasoned up we'll get our, our flat skillet pan nice and hot pans by calphalon i uh, love this pan it gets real hot but it's got a nice flat surface on it so that we can uh you can cook a lot of different things from pancakes to I like cooking off my chicken on there. So we got some lemon pepper seasoning. I like seasoning it all pretty, you know, really well for this kind of thing. Get them nice and both sides. Get them seasoned up. You see them in there. I like this uh, lemon pepper seasoning. It's got some salt in it, but not a lot. So it's uh, you know you don't have to really worry about over salting a lot of things. It's a good lemon pepper seasoning. So, it's uh, Spice Supreme, whoever makes that. A lot of them on the market these days, they put a ton of salt in them. But this one's pretty good. I don't like, you know, it doesn't have a lot of salt to it. And it's got good, uh, a lot of good lemon, lemon to it, lemon pepper. It makes a good base for, uh, for your barbecue chicken. It's got good flavor. So, I try to make sure to, Skin's all moved out so you can get that all crispy. You want to render, make sure all this fat gets rendered down so that when it's cold, you're not getting a mouthful of, you know, of fat. So get them nice and brown before you put them in the oven and then uh, finish cooking them off in the oven. There's our chicken right there. All right, guys, we got our uh, pan nice and hot. Here, so we want to get a real good sizzle when this goes down on there. Oh, I'm not tightening up. Turn them skin side down first. You, you know, doing it inside, you do have to put the exhaust fan on a little bit. And uh, it's gonna, you know, you can get some grease splatter. Just watch your temperature. So the first side we're going to get really, really crisp uh, first, then we'll flip them over and we're going to put them in a 350 degree oven. And I cook them usually for about 45 minutes. That usually gets all the fat drained out of them. So, Here we are again. Got a nice brown that's going on the skin. Guys, so we're going to flip them. 
And what we're going to do, we'll put them in the oven, cook them off, got a real nice color on them, got the skin nice and crispy. And then, uh, like almost when I'm done, I don't know, one of the best uh, barbecue sauces, I think, that's a bottled barbecue sauce that I'll make myself. I've always had good luck with Sweet Baby Ray's. It's a really good barbecue sauce, so I enjoy it. And uh, I'll put it on the chicken almost towards the end. I don't put it on early. And even if you're going out offshore, you can take the chicken like this, where it's all the way cooked through. Take some barbecue sauce with you. You can just squirt some into the bag and roll it around when you guys are ready to eat. Or you can just eat it this way. So we're going to put this in the oven. Like I said, for about 35 minutes, 45 minutes at 350 to uh, finish it off. And then it's a good, quick, easy, you know, tip for uh, having something offshore, canyon fishing, tuna fishing. Something easy, quick to grab out of the cooler. I'm back here with uh, our sponsor, Tips and Tricks, our sponsor, Boatloans.com. We uh, rendered it all off, so all the fat's down, it's nice and crispy, chicken's nice and tender. So I'm gonna just put a little bit of barbecue sauce on the top, and uh, Be ready to serve dinner. Got some sweet roasted sweet potatoes with it. And that's good to go. Uh, like I said, I want to shout out a big thanks to BoatLoans.com for uh, sponsoring our tips and tricks and hanging with Heavy. So uh, if you have any, uh, you need, need refinancing, new boat loans, Whatever you might need, please check out BoatLoans.com. And, uh, you know, try this next time you're getting ready for a canyon trip. A container worth of uh, chicken thighs is going to cost you probably less than, you know, around five bucks. And it uh, doesn't take a lot of time, maybe an hour, brown them up, throw them in the oven. You got a great little uh, canyon treat 